stuff. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do currently. I want to do stuff. Descriptive. I want to... I do want to do, um, continue this, but... Terraria is getting 1.4 in that battle. In a battle. About a week now, actually. No, just over. Just, just over a week. No, uh, no, under. No, sorry, under two weeks. That, that, that's what. The thing is that it adds more bosses. So that. I mean, luckily they don't start to a hard mode, but... The thing is, the only boss we have left... ...is the Wall of Flesh. Which starts hard mode, and from what I remember, there's one that's, um, like, either in supposed to be in between, or... ...or just after the mechanical bosses. Being twins, destroy and skeleton. I would put just. Which you know, it's ironically what order I want to face the mechanical bosses. But yeah, I have some preparations I need to do. First and foremost, more housing. I don't know how long or short this episode's going to be, by the way. Buy all the potions. This is only the start of preparations. Death and Rage, definitely. Magic Power, Mana Regeneration. That's about it. And I need a water bolt for something I want to try to. Oh, it worked, it worked, it worked. You're really going to do this to me? Okay, good. I've never really liked the old ones on me, I'll, I'll be honest there. At all. But, eh, I do need this one to try, especially for the fact that I do need this. Like, this is... Crap, it's only 10 seconds. Open that one. Okay, you fire bombs on the death. Towers. I didn't do the old ones army in my let's play like, like, because again I really do not like this again. Okay. Yeah, a lot better than the Pretty well the two changes that but yeah, this old one's army has a fine kind of still like a tower defense game. It's, it's a dungeon defense to cross over. And I go there. Oh wow. Yeah, this makes that nice try. Ah yes, this is where the where it starts becoming stupid. Flying. This is the main reason I keep this. Flying enemies. They are just. Are you 
Serious when I mean like ten times harder. I guess I had all the buffs. Oh, Gatoy, that's used in one of the things. Which I need the ninja enchantment, which I got in monk enchantment, which is monk armor, which I can't get to. I defeat a mechanical boss. So there are three tiers to the old ones, army. I might as well do it again while I still got my buffs up. I just realized something. Yeah. So there are three tiers, and they start. They start off at, as soon as you defeat the user of worlds of Rhinos Turtle. That will start. That will give you access to the old ones on the first place. And then tier two starts when you defeat your first mechanical boss. There should be a 30 second cooldown between waves, but... Eternity mode. So, huh. So, when tier 2 comes out, it, it gets its... The old one's only gets its 7 waves. And there's a lot more enemies, but you can actually get some loot for once. Oh, and also, if you try to build, um, it doesn't work. Because you get this. You've lost the power of reaction. You can't build one more. Now here's where the hard part comes in. Wall of Flesh in Eternity Mode has quite a lot to it. And I'm actually a bit concerned about how difficult this might be. need a lot of room for this. Okay, part one. The mouth has... Um... 1,206 defense. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. Yeah. That is going to be very tough to counter. It's 
basically every weapon in the game will do zero da uh, one damage. And also these guys, uh, hunk, um, leeches, one and two. Part two, the eyes sh the eyes shoot thing, um, basically shoot death rays. No, no, I'm not joking. They actually shoot. They actually shoot their own phantasmal death rays. If you don't know what those are, it's a it's a moon lord attack. I mean, the the lucky thing is these don't move, and we've got an indicator before one of them comes up. There's like a small mini laser that goes into a big laser. By the way, I use one, two, three, four, five instant bridges in hell already. So you have a bit of knowing what's about to come, but the main thing is the fact that if you get hit by them, it's most likely game over. Because what's going to happen is... You get confused, you get a ton of debuffs that make you slower and stuff. And get a lot harder to dodge. I mean, to, to recover if you dodge. And, um, the gravity's flipped. Oh, I forgot to say things. Get out, you're not even a free hard mode mod. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Broken. I've got so many hard mode items that shouldn't have a drop rate at all. Okay, part three. Um, so you can't hit the mouth. Of the wall of flesh. You physically can't do it. Well you can, but it has so much defense. So you have to hit the eyes. Part three. Every time an eye shoots a phantasmal death ray, well, it's not—I don't actually know what it's called. It's probably called like a death ray or something. Every time it shoots one, it goes invincible till, but and makes the other eye vulnerable. Part four. Upon reaching half health, it starts spewing. Oh, spawns a wall. A wall of um. I call that slowly goes in. And then after that's done it'll start spewing out I call like there's no tomorrow. Fun. Yeah, part five. There is no catching up to the wall of flesh if you die. There is no catching up to it. If you die, just wait for it to despawn. Because it, it moves at 25 billion kilometers an hour. Or so. If you can catch it, I'll be surprised. <laughs> and that's to make sure that you can't abuse it. Yeah. And part 6, at 10% health, it's basically going, I can't, it has like a phase 3, I think it just spews out more things. Something. As well as it already had, um, part 7, it's the wall of flesh, it, it goes at, tw and it's an expert mode wall of flesh, it goes at 20 billion kilometers an hour. Luckily I have an actual bridge that, on my side this time. So that shouldn't be too much of a problem, I hope.
It's despawned already? Ugh. 
that was not fun at all. <laughs> <laughs>